famous. This is there is such a thing in as famous cervical, in the cervix cervix where there is a squamo columnar junction, and this is the squamo columnar junction. We can see the simple columnar here, tall, um, basically located nuclei. Um, whereas the stratified squamous is squamous, you know, stratified meaning it's on one top of the other. And the more it becomes to the very top, it becomes thin out. The cells will become spindle, whereas in the basal portion, it's still rounded. That is the normal um, squamocolumnar junction. But for, you know, with cervix, a lot of stress or whatever, um, you know, uh, that is exposed to um, the columnar will somehow be changed into stratified squamous. So that, but that's what we call the squamous metaplasia. So you can see there's still the normal columnar area but you can already see, you know, this. you can still appreciate the columnar here, but evidently it's already going to be changed into the squamous type. So that's, this is a very common thing to see though. So um, let's just say, I think 99% of women will, will have this basically. We see this and it's, we just comment on it, but I don't think it's pre-marine. Uh, there's no study that it's pre-marine. It's just an adaptive change of your body, I guess. So next slide. 